Apple Spring Lineup New iPad Air, iPad Pro, MacBook Air Vision Pro Global Launch Apple enthusiasts can expect a flurry of releases this spring, according to reports by Bloomberg's Mark Gurman. The anticipated lineup includes refreshed iPad Air and iPad Pro models, alongside multiple MacBook Airs, all possibly hitting the shelves as early as March or April. Following these releases, attention will shift to Apple's WWDC in June. The upcoming iPad Air models, sporting 10.9-inch and 12.9-inch displays, are expected to feature Apple's M2 chip for enhanced performance, a redesigned camera bump, Wi-Fi 6E support, and Bluetooth 5.3. Despite these updates, no major external design changes are anticipated. The current fifth-generation iPad Air, equipped with the M1 chip, made its debut in March 2022. The next-gen 11-inch and 13-inch iPad Pro models are poised to be Apple's first iPads with OLED displays, promising improved brightness, contrast ratio, and lower power consumption. The switch to OLED may increase costs. Additional features include Apple's M3 chip, MagSafe wireless charging, and a revamped Magic Keyboard. Like the iPad Air, changes to the rear camera bump are also possible. The current iPad Pro models with the M2 chip were released in October 2022. Apple plans to simultaneously release 13-inch and 15-inch MacBook Airs featuring the M3 chip. These models will introduce hardware-accelerated ray tracing and mesh shading for superior graphics rendering in games. While no major design changes are expected, Wi-Fi 6E support is likely. The 13-inch MacBook Air was last updated in July 2022, and the first-ever 15-inch model debuted in June 2023. In addition, Apple is making waves with its Vision Pro, a VR spatial computing device. Despite a hefty $3,499 price tag, initial pre-orders exceeded analyst Min Kai Kuo's expectations, reaching between 160,000 to 180,000 units. Kuo notes that, despite this, the Vision Pro remains a niche product, constituting only 0.007% of Apple's vast user base. While the device sold out quickly, sustaining demand and expanding its appeal beyond enthusiasts may pose a challenge for Apple as it prepares for a global launch, potentially before this year's WWDC in June.